Hello everyone and welcome back to Vault 88. All right, let's get to it. Oh wait, first, before we start building, I wanted to just let you guys know that I cleared this side of the tunnels. I ran out of steel while I was practicing building and I needed more, so I just went and scrapped everything. I cleared this side. Um, I decided not to, to do those this stuff in the video because I wanted the videos to be filled with building things and if I had cleared this in the video it would have taken up the whole video and I'm sure you guys really don't care to see it I mean you've all done it like just recently it's not like you need to see me do it I'm, I'm pretty sure most of you if not all of you of course my battery's low I'm pretty sure most of you if not all of you would rather see me build things so that's what I'm going to be doing as you can see, I have built an elevator shaft. Now, if you didn't see my video that I posted yesterday on how to build this elevator shaft, then uh, what are you waiting for? Go watch it. <laughs> so I'm going to connect it to the overseer's office. I did remove the stairs. I hated them, to be honest. They take up a ton of space. And I want to build other things here instead. And the elevator is so much more compact. So, yeah, if you want to know how to build that, go watch my video on how to build vault elevators. I'll leave a link in the description in case you absolutely cannot find it. <laughs> it's like I posted it yesterday, but, you know, you could be watching this a year from now and don't know where it's at. Anyway... Let's go up and finish connecting it to the overseer's office, because I haven't done that yet. All right, so I'm going to put the security office on this side again. I took it away over there too, so. All right, so we need, let me see. I think I'll do one more, yeah, one more hall piece and then I'll put the security office right here. Nah, not this one. How about the curved one? Or the one that has, not that one, the one that curves. There, that one. That way I can put the door here. We can have a sign right here that says Overseer, if they have one. I haven't looked at all the signs, but they probably do. Alright, now we need oh yes, an end cap. Blah. Oh, by the way, I discovered that end caps are a lie. You don't need them. Well, that's not completely true. They're mostly a lie. You don't you need them initially to put on the end of, you know what, it's too close. Let's, I'll show you why end caps are a lie in a minute. We need to extend this out a little bit farther. It's a little too close, so, so it won't. Oh, not a, not a, not a door piece. I want, not a window one either. Eh, how about that one? So it's a little bit different. There, now the corner piece. It was too close to the um, the elevator. It wasn't going to snap in, but that's okay. Uh, this one, yes. Okay, there. All right, now, end caps are a lie. Let's talk about that. <laughs> you do need them initially, but you don't need them forever. And I'll show you why you might want to not use them forever here in a second. So now we need to add the door corner. Not that one. This one. You need them to initially attach things. But look what they do. Look what it does. They have clipping issues. What in the world, Bethesda? Why would they design that to have a clipping issues? And I noticed they all do that. 
They all do that. But you don't need... Once you have the room attached, you can take the cap off. I know it looks funny, but you're going to add a door. And the door has its own end cap on it. And it makes a complete door. I mean, it does. It doesn't have, I guess, this little curvy part here on the side. But so what? I don't know. It doesn't, it's not, it's not fighting with the other pieces like it would if there was an end cap there. <sighs> Go figure, I don't know. I've discovered that a lot of this vault tech stuff is extremely flawed. I mean, look, you can't even put it back in there once the door is in. can't even put it back. Oh, wow. Okay, anyways, you guys, you don't need to use the end caps. If you find that they have a lot of flickering going on that you don't like, I, I guess they might not do it all the time, but they seem to do it most of the time. Just take it off. It really looks fine without it, I think. Anyway, let's keep building this. Okay, now we need corner piece. Um, solid corner. There we go. And then I'm going to put a little, a little walkway that goes to the overseer's office, which I actually liked better. It, it, uh, it worked. I like how it worked. So let's see one that doesn't have windows. I don't like windows that are looking out. Um, might not go in. Alright. So if it doesn't go in, sometimes order matters. Just... Oh wait. Oh, I know. I didn't have an end cap. Because it's stupid and I have to put an end cap on in order for it to attach. Oh wait a second. There we go. Or, let me see. I can get the... I need the tunnel that has a door on it. Now these are these should attach to the door. These room pieces have... I don't know. Last time I used... Okay, when I was practicing this, it snapped right in. Which is just odd that it's not now. There it goes. It was this one. Yeah, hallway to doorway. That's what I needed. Alright. <laughs> hallway to doorway, everybody. And you don't need to put an end cap on it. There! Then we I moved her desk over because I didn't want people to just walk right in on top of her desk. Because it was sitting right here. So then I can put a sitting room here. And then I'm going to build her quarters coming off the side down here. But I'm not going to do that today because I had an idea for something else that you guys are going to probably like. So let's go down. Oops. <laughs> We're on the third floor already. <laughs> Actually, I wanted to go to the second floor. Oh well. Oh! I also wanted to <laughs> talk about this. So all of you guys, well, not all of you, but a lot of you, told me that there was a cap, a corner cap, for this. And I didn't see it. I don't know why. I so just did not see it. Um, it's on the very end and it has the corner in there. It's attached to the floor and the ceiling for some stupid reason. So I had to take out all of these. And it's really weird. When you remove one of these, a lot of the rest of them will just fall through the floor. It's really odd. Let's see. <coughs> anyway, so, and if you watched my elevator video, you know what those things that I had right there are for. They do snap to the outside corners of the vault wall, or the, uh, not vault walls. Oh, these are vault walls. These walls, these atrium walls. They snap 
into these corners here on the outside. So that's what those are for. <laughs> Go figure. Anyways, thank you guys for telling me about this piece. I don't know how I missed it. There it is right there on the end. I don't know. It's sometimes hard to see the pieces. Does anyone else have that problem? I, I find myself just completely missing pieces in these. There's so many and they all look so similar to each other. It's hard to tell, you know, which one to use anyway. All right, <clears throat> I'm going to build something up here now. I'm going to build a second level on top of these things because I had an idea and I played around with it a little bit and I started liking it, so I decided to, to do it. <clears throat> now, in the atrium tab here, I'm going to extend the floor out a little bit because it's... I want it to be less claustrophobic, all right? Less claustrophobic. And let's see, I'm going to... Um, put some floors. <clears throat> now, as you can see, I'm leaving a couple spaces. And I think... Um, no, let's put that one back. Hmm. Well, let's go with it and see what happens. I'm going to put this, not that, um, this there in these spaces here so that it's pillar <clears throat> pillars are holding up this area, okay? So I actually need to put a floor. <laughs> I missed that one. Don't need a pillar there. All right. So then I need to put the roof pieces. Where is it? It's this one. Those will snap on to this. Wah! I fell down. There we go. All right. So it extends it out a little bit and then it's a little more open and airy and not so claustrophobic. So now I'm going to put, um, let's see. I'm going to put even more floors. I'm going to make it more open even. Cause I want to put a cafe. I think I'm going to put a cafe up here. How did I get those even? Yes. Okay. So the posts are even. <laughs> typical. Okay. Typical. Uh, there's not a railing there. Or are they even? No, that one's... Well, yeah, okay. It's it's good enough. I don't need it to be perfect. I don't need it to be... It can't be the same because I got seven... I got seven um, tiles. Okay. It's okay. At least it's not blocking the walkway. I am going to have... Probably a hallway going down the middle... But I'm not sure where yet. For now, I'm going to be making... So I'm going to make like a... I could put a shop here. And I was thinking of putting the cafe here instead of down there. Or maybe I can have more than one place that sells food. I don't know. I want this vault to be like a city. So not just like one store and one cafe like the like Vault 81, you know? They have one because it's only for the Vault residents. But I I want my vault to be like 
an underground city, not just a vault for the vault dwellers. Like it will be open to visitors who would come and do, you know, trade with them. So that's what I want it to be like. And so now I'm going to put windows and doors here to make a store. Um, okay, that's odd. There. <laughs> okay, so then I can put a store that goes out back here and yeah, it could be long and skinny or whatever. All right, now I'm going to put a store also. So this will be the cafe entrance and I need a window. Of course. What? What? It's not gonna let me snap that in. I'm gonna put one on that side at least. Oh come on, Bethesda, really? Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Um. What else could we do here? Um. One of these. Let's try one of these. Will it snap to one of those? <laughs> okay. Except then it's gonna do this. It's gonna do that. <sighs> Not to mention that these doors, these prefabs don't match the singles. See, it's got this yellow bar painted across the top and it's got like rust dripping down it and these pieces don't have that. It's very frustrating to me that they don't match. And it's got this yellow thing here and of course these don't. I mean I understand why these tiles don't because you want to put them in the middle too and they don't you don't want that yellow line across but then in that case they shouldn't have put one here. It's like nothing matches. I mean look the yellow line extends Boom, 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 and then it's gone, and then it starts again, and then it's gone for the rest of the way around. I don't think they planned these pieces very well. Not to mention, they just, they don't interact with each other very well. It's like the worst interaction of pieces that I have ever seen. <sighs> okay, rant over. Sorry, you guys. I know I do that a lot in these, but I don't know. I'm more of a perfectionist than the developers, I guess. All right, so let's see. Is that going to be big enough for the... Should it be... So I think I'm going to put maybe even one more window there. And then I'm going to put a hallway right here. Then I'm going to put a door here because I'm going to build another shop on this side all right I don't know what it will be I'm not going to make it today so we'll we'll see we'll see what it ends up being but I'm going to put I think a hallway right here I think Maybe that's too big. Because I want to put some quarters. I'm going to start putting the, the people's quarters. So... No, you know what? I'm going to put the hallway right here instead. I just think it will fit better with my plan. My plan, which I will show you in a minute. <laughs> Okay, so I know it's not in line with the the walkway, but I don't think it really needs to be. <clears throat> All right, let's get a hallway and we will probably need a door piece, of course. I do need a door. <laughs> I forgot the door. Which, what? Do I need an end cap? Or can I just put the door there and then put the the thing? If I put the right thing, I need to find the one as the door 
in it already. There we go. And then... Um... I think... Uh, let's see. How big do I want the cafe to be? Look at this. Look at how horrible that is. That is just na not good. I mean... Oh well. What can you do? <laughs> Alright. I'm trying to decide how big I want my... my, um, my cafe. To decide how... Because I want a couple rooms back here on each side. So I'm trying to decide. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see. Not one with a window. Let's now put a door. One with a door. Or one with two doors. Do they have one with two doors? Um, there we go. Two doors. So then we can walk into a qu um, somebody's quarters. But I don't feel like that might be not- that might not be big enough for um, a cafe though. Yeah, I'm thinking it might not be. Alright, let's put one more... Um one more hallway piece on here. Then the one with the doors. Uh, there we go. There. There. Then the cafe can be big enough. Alright, so the cafe then... Whoops. We want cafe pieces. And so then we want the one with the windows. Oh, right. We need... A f um, did, are they not going to snap to this? No, it'll snap to the door. Good. And the one with the windows. No, wait. I want a corner one. Oh, they're not going to have corner ones with windows, are they? <gasps> oh, they're not. Of course not. Why would they? Why would they provide something like that for us, huh? Why would they provide corner windows? Oh, that is not fun because the windows are going to be in the corners. <sighs> Fine. I just want to have windows in the corners then. That's no fun. I wanted windows. I suppose I could make the corner extend out that way. So I can have at least one window. I want at least one. And then I can go like that. And we'll just have a little alcovey thing. Oh, it's not gonna go. It's not gonna go. Ah! I can't have any windows in my... <laughs> oh, man. That is so frustrating, Bethesda. You didn't give us corner windows. And this stupid red thing has to be in the way, so I can't actually put a piece here. They said that they designed this so that pieces fit perfectly in it, but no, they didn't. It's too small. Okay. I really wanted windows in my cafe. I didn't want my cafe to be claustrophobic, so maybe I'll make this into something else. Alright. Well, I'll fix it later, you guys. For now, I wanted to do... continue making the... the hallway and the rooms. I have to kind of decide... I have to think about that one for a while. Longer than the length of this episode is going to allow. And you guys probably don't want to just sit here watching me think to myself without talking, so... Alright, so we're going to make... That will be a shop with no windows, apparently. Oh, Sanctuary Hills, boo-hoo. And no, with no windows. Ah, that's just so aggravating. I want windows. 
I wish they made these so they weren't prefabs. I hate using prefabs. Why, why couldn't they give us just walls and ceilings and floors? I don't get it. Oh well. I do want to make these quarters, so I'm going to make some quarters back here and a quarters quarters there. And then let's see, how many can extend beyond this? None. Of course. So I want a curving one then, so we can go to the side. Come on. There we go. And I want to put an elevator over here that can go down there as well as up to the next level because I want to put quarters above these ones as well. So we need to I need to extend the hallway. Well, let me see how far do I need to extend it? All right, just one more, I guess. Maybe I can do one with a window so that the people who own this house No. Can't do corner windows, never mind. <sighs> Okay, so one that doesn't have a window. Make sure it doesn't have a door in it either. And then one that does have a door so that we can, um, actually this one. Cause then I can put a room here and then I'm going to put my elevator right here, I think. Oh, I don't know, it might not fit right there. No. Whoa, stuck. Okay. No, let's let's see. Let's see if I can extend it out even one more. Um Could I do a window here? Now that'll still end up being a corner though, wouldn't it? For that those quarters. Let me check. Come on, get on there. Get on. Okay. Um yeah, it'll still end up being a corner. <laughs> Nobody's having windows in their quarters, I guess. Oh well. Okay. Let's put another hallway. And then one with the corner. No, not the corner. The junction. Not the four-way junction. The two-way... Three-way junction. There we go. Alright. So now I can put a room here. Um, I don't know what it will be. But I'm going to put the elevator coming off here. So I need a door. An end cap. Get on there. Alright, now let's go down. Alright, so... So you can see this store will end about right there. And then there will be some quarters that will come out to here. I think. I don't know, or maybe it will just be a closet. I guess we'll see how, how it all ends up fitting together in the end. I suppose I could put the elevator way out here. Mm, I don't know. So now we need to get an elevator in there and elevators won't snap to these things. So I have to put... Um, let's see, not that one, this one. Yeah. I need to snap that down there. Alright. That way we can have I think this I think this will fit. It might not actually. 
I haven't... Oh, pff, my timer. I forgot to mute that. <laughs> I, I forgot to... Um test it. I, I didn't forget to test this. I just haven't tested this. So I don't know if this is going to work, you guys. So I apologize in advance if I use up the rest of this episode with trying to figure out, figure out this and then it doesn't work. But, because the elevator needs some space around it. I wish I could add one more uh, piece on here, but you can't. It seems like there should be room. Let's no. Let me just try it again from from this side. Because there's a lot of room here and you'd think that it would fit, but when I tried to put it on before it wouldn't, so I don't know what the deal is. Oh, it's gonna work. <laughs> well, fine. Let's let's use it then. Because I actually did want it out farther than that. There. Except now I need to add one because I... Oops, I took one away. I need to add uh, another one of these. Uh, that one's probably fine. Alright. I think that'll work. Okay. And back to the junction again. This one. Okay, come on, get on there. Alright, now put the door cap back on. No. There. That just gives it a little bit more room. Because I have to put a hallway coming out here. And I think the elevator wouldn't have fit. Otherwise, I'm going to put the elevator here. Alright. Hopefully that works. So I'm going to put the elevator <clears throat> in next. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I have to put <clears throat> some floors down to snap it to. So, um, oh. Uh, let's just do this. That's That'll be easier. These are temporary, by the way, just so you know. Because <laughs> I'm... Oops. Come on. I just need to snap the elevator to it right here. Okay. Elevator. Let's do four stories. We can go that high, so why not? <clears throat> Turn it so it's facing the right direction. And then we'll remove these because we're going to be putting corridors here instead. Oh, oops, I removed it too soon. <laughs> I forgot to put the wall on. <laughs> I forgot. I need to put the wall on it. This one. There. Now I can remove them. All right. I guess you guys <laughs> didn't need to go watch my elevator building video. Actually, I don't need to build the entire thing right now. I just want to power it up, though. I do want to power it up, so I'm going to do that. You guys can go watch my how to build an elevator build, uh, video to watch me build this. I don't want to use up this entire episode with things that you've seen already. So... Not the entire thing, anyway. Whoops. Oh, did I stick them on the right side? No. <sighs> right. What am I doing? I am completely... <laughs> I'm completely losing my train of thought. And I put these walls on the wrong side. Because then, how would we get on? Okay. You guys probably saw me doing that and you're like, Oh, no. No, I caught it. I caught it. Not okay. There. There. Because we need to put a hallway here. So 
so that we can get in. You know, I'm going to have a hallway coming off here and going to the elevator. <laughs> so, anyways. <sighs> Oops. I just want to power up the elevator so that I can go up it, up and down it. It's easier than running all the way over to the stairs, right? Boom. All right, there we go. <clears throat> Let's go up just one level. Since we don't have anything up on the other levels yet. All right, good. So then there will be quarters right on the other side of this and hopefully they'll fit. Hopefully they'll fit. All right. <clears throat> anyway, I I like how it's starting to look. I just am not liking the fact that I can't put windows here in corners. Because it looks really nice with windows. And if it doesn't have windows, it's going to be very claustrophobic. And I don't like claustrophobic. That's why I'm trying to make this as big and as airy as I can, you know? I mean, these people are living underground. That's going to be really depressing after a while. You want it as open as possible. At least I do. I do. I don't want it to feel like a bunker, you know? <laughs> so I'm not sure what to do here. And I'm sorry, you guys. I thought I would be able to build a complete room for you. And so you can see... Yeah, complete room. But I can't put a window. I guess I could have one window here if I... Um... If I... <clears throat> have the wall extend over then I can have a window in here so if I was going to have a shop in here let me see what sort of what is this tiles no uh, nur not nursery overseer quarters Ugh. security is that the only wallpaper they have for the quarters that's really awful that's really awful Cafeteria. And cafeteria's got food and stuff on them, so I can't use that for anything else. So there's just this. Okay. Well, whatever. Okay, I'm just getting stuck on something here. <clears throat> so I could do that. Yeah. <clears throat> See, I could do it this way, but then it would have that blue wall. And that would look dumb. I mean, or I don't know, would it? Would it look dumb? Could I just do it like this and have that be the wall? I don't know. I suppose I could. I mean, why not? But I really want, because I really want windows in the fronts, you know? And so if I did that over here with the, the potential cafe, What would that look like? Oh, I need to put the door on first. What would that look like? It doesn't match. You know? It doesn't match. Hmm. Because then... Um, all the rest of the walls will have that on it. And I can't... <laughs> I just, I wish they were separated, the ceilings, you know, because all the ceilings look the same. No matter what tab you're in, you know, all the ceilings look the same. So they could have just ceilings, except for this, they would have to have like half size ceilings maybe. But look at that. That's just like extra paneling that's... They could have that separate from... 
that's like the no the the basic one with the extra paneling sort of just stuck in there and different floor they could just have I don't know I think they didn't design these good enough they didn't design these to go up against each other in all ways they should have had a corner window or just having them separated from each other you know why couldn't they it makes it so I can't do what I want to do <laughs> whoops I need to put it a corner there um corner there we no that's not a corner where's the corner There it is. <laughs> All right. So then, if I put the window, I'm not just missing it, am I? I'm not just missing it, right? There isn't a corner window. There's a solid corner. There's the door corners. There's a corner corner with no window, which. I don't know. I, I, bleh. <laughs> bleh. Tell me if I'm missing it, you guys. I have missed things before, as I'm sure you've noticed. But I'm not missing. There's not a corner window. All right. There we go. Oh. Right, I can't put a wall there because this is in the way. This corner's in the way. I can't put... Ugh! I think I need to stop recording before I scream. Anyway, let me know what you guys think of just having that bear like that. I don't really want to have it bare like that. I suppose I could... I suppose I could have... It like this. And then have just the back wall painted like that. Would it look dumb to have it like this, you guys? Oh my gosh, I can't even... I can't even have it as large as I wanted it to. You know what? I'm starting to think I don't want to have the cafe right here after all. Because if I have it just too wide and three deep, I just don't feel like that's big enough to tell you the truth. I really wanted it. I can't put another one over here. Even a corner piece. I can't, I can't put it there. I mean, I suppose I could have it shaped all funky and weird by putting these here. And then and then what? What do I do with that side? Have it just no window, I guess not have a window piece there have a solid one um, and then put a solid wall there I suppose I could do it like that oh no I need to put a corner there Um, where's the corner? Oh, they're so hard to see. There. I always pass it, too. Alright. Alright, tell me what you guys think about that. This is potentially large enough. I was hoping I could have that whole corner, but... And then what do you think of having this just plain old blue wall? It's really ugly and gross and looks really dirty. 
I mean, I don't know if people would want to sit next to that to eat. I mean, I suppose I'm not... I don't know if you can hang pictures on the outsides of the vault pieces. Let's see. I have never tried. Can you hang stuff on these? Oh, you can. Maybe I can... Well, not, not on this part. Well, sort of. Maybe I can just cover it with pictures. Maybe I could... Where do they have the vault posters? Are those under posters? Are they like... Where do they have the vault posters at? They're not at the end of these. I don't remember scrolling them that... F scrolling. Are they under miscellaneous? No. Where do they have the vault posters, you guys? <laughs> it's like, not like you can really answer me like this right this second. But I could just cover them with like this kind of stuff. I could, I could put these up here, and I could put them, like a bunch of them, on it. It's gonna clip through a tiny bit right there. Oh, that's totally not straight. Oops. It clips through just a little bit, but I guess... I don't know. Actually, that's clipping through quite a bit. Well, maybe I can off-center it. Eh! Whatever. I can pretend it's wallpaper. You know, I've done that in some of my other settlements. I pretended this stuff was wallpaper. And it uh, actually doesn't look too bad. So it is going to clip through a little smidgen, but maybe it's not so bad if I can just cover this entire wall with paintings. And then it'll be a really sort of half retro, half 50s style cafe. <laughs> you know? <laughs> so. What do you think? <laughs> What do you think? It might be all right. I don't know. Maybe somebody in the vault is an artist and they wanted to sell their work here. <laughs> yeah, they do. Sometimes they put art for sale in cafes from local artists, you know? I don't know if they do that where you live, but they do do that where I live. So maybe that's what they're doing. I don't know. I could probably live with that. I would, I would tweak the paintings a little better so that they look a little better. I mean, obviously, you know, um, I was just putting up there real quick to see if it would even be doable. And it possibly is. Then I can have the windows, or at least one window. And uh, maybe I can put the kitchen back here. Maybe I can put... I, I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Tell me, tell me what you think of that cafe and if that if that'll work. If that looks good with the paintings. Alright. And so next episode, I think I'm going to call this one good. Next episode, I will probably be building this shop. And I could do the same thing with this shop too. Of course, with a shop, it might not be so bad to have just the blank wall. Because I can cover it with shelves instead. We'll see. And then I'm going to be building more quarters and stuff so I think unless I come up with another idea for something else to do but I really want to get the quarters fixed up so I can start getting settlers here and then I can continue the quest and get all of the stuff freed up you know so I can use it outside the vault because I want to finish Abernathyville and I can't do that until I finish the vault quest all right so I'm going to be working on getting the quarters made so I can get settlers here. All right. I think that is going to do it for now, you guys. Give me your opinions, your suggestions. I very much appreciate it. Tell me what you think of this open area. I think I like this. I have to add some more um, ceiling here. I forgot to add the ceiling there, but yeah. Anyway. Tell me what you think of that, and I will see you guys in the next one, okay? Until then, remember to play safe, play nice, and have fun. I will see you later, guys. Bye.